Good evening, welcome to a night edition of Richter Solves Lead Code Problems. I didn't have time during a day, so I'm recording now. I need to be quiet, but I can still do this. Now let's move to problem best time buy, to buy and sell stock 2. This is day 5 of Lead Code 30 day challenge. And as suggested in the comments, if I see some possible harder versions of a problem, I will also talk about them. I have a timer and oh, again, orange tick mark means I already solved this problem in the past. Let's go. You have an RI, price of on the UI, find maximum profit. You can complete as many transactions as you like, buy one and sell one share later. You may not engage in multiple transactions at the same time. You must sell stock before you buy again. This is an extremely well-known DP problem where we go through the prices and we do the following. If we had a stock, then we can sell it. So from, um, let's say that it can be long, long, I think not int, int best without stock is zero. Uh, best with stock, we consider that to be maximum of itself and best without stock minus x. If you had ten dollars and now the price is free, then seven is possible money you have and you have a stock. But also best without stock is max of itself and best with stock plus x. If you had Ten dollars and you had stock in your hand, you can sell it and then this is how, man, how much money you have and you are without a stock. Best without stock, best with stock is uh, minus infinity or something like that. Minus infinity, I like to create a variable for that. Because int means sometimes overflows if you add something to that. Then return best without stock. At the end you cannot own a stock. Run code because I'm not that sure but I'm still below two minutes. Correct, submit. It's accepted but now I will talk about some possible modifications because this was kind of DP. I can also say this. I create dpri, dp of n by 2 and now dp of i, at moment i, with some, let's say, j, this is best possible money so far, max possible amount of money to get to the situation, at to get to moment i, with j items in hand. If, if we were allowed to even have more than one at hand at the same time. And this, by the way, provides O of n times k solution for problem like that. Uh, you can, well, basically problem without this, this limitation, that you may not engage in multiple transactions at the same time. If we are given k, and it's, it is said you can own at most k items, k units of the stock, then it, you will create dp of n by k, with this definition and also you can it's it's okay if this is not limited at all if you then it will be dp of n n you can have at most n items and then with iterative dp we will move from i j either to dp of i plus one j if we do nothing dp of i j to dp of i plus one j minus one dp of i j to dp of i minus one j plus one this represents getting rid of one item of stock. So exact line for this will be dp of i plus 1, j minus 1, is maximum of itself, comma, dp of i, j, plus the price, uh, price of i. Because it means we had like 7 units and now we have 6. So our money is increased by the price of this item. If you want to learn more about iterative dp, I strongly, strongly recommend my series on YouTube, free videos 
and they will teach you how to approach the pin iterative way. And it's very powerful because it's so much easier to compute the complexity and uh, codes become very short. Plus, sometimes you can use more complicated techniques like prefix sums to get even better complexity. It isn't possible in this problem. And I already got, by the way, of one space complexity with this solution. I don't, uh, if I explicitly create a DP of n by 2, it would be O of n space complexity. Well, right now I have O of 1 space, space and O of n time. Because I go through prices and for each of them I have some two operations. At the very moment, best without stock and best with stock is the best possible, maximum possible amount of money I have if also I want to have stock in my hand. Actually, is it okay to use a word stock? Uh, if element is the price of given stock, yes. So the best without stock is dp of i0, best with stock is dp of i1 in this solution. That's it, I don't want to make it too long and I'm actually going to sleep. So good night and bye bye.